<coughs> okay, what is going on guys? Baku Sky here again with another video and today we're gonna go for the uh, loadout I'm gonna be using for the GM coming out this week, which is uh, the really easy one. What is it called? Anywho, um, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. So first thing I'm going with power preservation. Uh, basically like this whole entire build is gonna be surrounded by keeping myself alive as well as uh, keeping my allies uh, with orbs of power and things like that. So power preservation, my super final blows create extra orbs for my teammates. Um, I got Aeon Swifts on so I can create ammo for them. Uh, we will be rocking unstoppable fusion rifle with overload bow. <clears throat> so for the chest piece, I have taken charge with concussive dampener and void resistance because there will be void damage uh, as well as solar damage in this, but mostly, I believe it's mostly void. Uh, on the boots here, we have Kindling the Flame, uh, which will give me a burst of healing when I um, revive a downed opponent. Of course, I got the Fusion Scav on, and then I got re Recuperation, replenishes health each time I pick up an Orb of Power. And then, so for the Cloak, we, ha we have Thermal Classic Strike, for overload champions and then we have renaissance siphon uh so every time a champion is stunned i get my abilities back so that i can further aid my teammates and then we have elemental shards uh which is going to be paired up really nice with grim harvest because it'll give me stasis shards in which i can run through them and replenish my uh my abilities as well with the lowest current energy Weapons, we're going to go with Ignition Code, Blinding GL with Vorpal, Tiku's Divination for them Overload Champions, and Threaded Needle with Vorpal uh, to make sure that, you know, obviously we get those the deeps out there. Obviously the class I'm going with is Revenant. And yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoy, hit the like button, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.